Hi, I'm Dr. Jonathan Blankafor. I'm a general surgeon here at Middlesex Hospital. I'm a member of the uh, Sherwin Surgical Associates uh, Surgical Group, and I have a special interest in laparoscopic colorectal surgery. When a patient is diagnosed with colon cancer, one of the most important things is, is to stage the patient to see if, if, if in fact there has been spread of the disease to, uh, to any other part of the body. Um, to this end, we will often order things like a CAT scan or a PET scan. The next step, once we are sure that uh, there's been no spread, is to actually plan the operation. Um, this involves um, actually doing something called a bowel prep, which I'm sure you probably had when you, when you, you uh, had your colonoscopy. Uh, but it is one of the most important parts of the procedure. Once uh, this is completed, uh, we will plan your operation and, and plan to do that laparoscopically. So instead of doing a big, big cut uh, to get the uh, tumor out, we can make a series of small incisions and uh, watching uh, the action on a, a high definition video screen remove the tumor quite uh, efficiently. The, the, the benefit of uh, smaller incisions is obviously less pain. Uh, this, this translates into a much faster recovery. So instead of having a perhaps a five to seven uh, day hospital stay, most folks are out in three to four days. One of the things we do here at Middlesex that uh, many of the other hospitals in the state do not is to uh, ensure protection of the ureter. Now, what is the ureter? The ureter is the, that uh, hollow tube that takes urine from the kidney down to the bladder. Uh, one of the uh, risks of, of doing any uh, colon procedure, be it laparoscopic or open, is injury to that structure. Um, the way we protect the ureter here at Middlesex is that one, one of our uh, urologic co uh, colleagues would uh, look into your bladder with a, a special scope and, and place something called a stent uh, into the ureter. Um, through that stent goes a, a fiber optic fiber which is hooked up to an infrared light source. The camera that we use to do the actual procedure can see both visible and infrared light. So actually these, uh, the ureters will light up like, uh, like a neon sign basically. Uh, the, the benefit of uh, using these uh, specialized uh, infrared uh, uh, ureteral uh, stents is that we can visualize the ureter quite quickly. That allows us to go very, really very low on the blood supply to the colon. And as I mentioned before, it's, it's, a, it's really important to get uh, very low so you uh, can maximize the number of lymph nodes that you harvest uh, during the procedure, as that does have a, a bearing on, on survival and recurrence. The advantage to having the surgery here in Middlesex is that uh, you have highly trained surgeons who actually do the operations. 